feel like I belong in the school, I'm definitely getting the sense that I'll be here and I'll always be ready to help people. Starting this um, Club Canevin uh, has been a really positive experience and there were lots of different reasons why I wanted to start it. We did a, a project back in the summer exploring oral scene storytelling and what came out of that was um, the fact that our pupils felt that their voice wasn't heard, their voice wasn't important, their voice didn't matter and from that outcome I felt it was really important that we explore that further through a really creative different way uh, working with Wayne and looking at filmmaking. Well, I've learned how to use the camera, how to use the lights, how like to monitor sound, like how to set up all the equipment and what will make a good place for recording. We've been um, kind of uh, learning about how to use all the different equipment and tools and then we've obviously started to decide what kind of thing we would like to do with the Canavan product, so we decided to um, interview the teachers and obviously interview a few of us as well and um, I think it's been really a really good experience. We went to the hall and everyone like wrote down like some questions and me and Grace like tweaked them. It was quite easy to do so because we knew the topic that it was based off and we had um, questions that we could um, base them off as well. Canevin to me um, I think firstly means a sense of well-being, sense of feeling happy, feeling like I belong. I also think um, I link Canevin to people who are important in my life, so my family, uh, my friends, pupils, who I teach here every day, and my colleagues who I work with, and that gives me that sense of kind of um, that happiness and that belonging too. I also think that my identity, being Welsh, um, links to a strong part of my Canevin too. My main Canevin to me is my family. That is where I am most happy. Um, we are really outdoorsy kind of people. Uh, we love to go to the beach. Um, we love to go on woodland walks. You know, seeing my children happy is what um, Canevin is to me. From my understanding of it and from what I've heard other people talk about, it's your sense of belonging, your, your home, I grew up in a different area to, to where I live now, but Pembrokeshire is, is my home and my sense of belonging and my sense of community is very much Pembrokeshire based and focused. Well, it's about belonging, isn't it? It's about trying, I think it's about trying to find your place in the world and whether that means being the Prime Minister or doing a job like mine where I'm trying to help children is trying to find a little niche that you can fit into and do the best that you can. Yes, I definitely feel a sense of Canevin within the LLC faculty. Um, we are a great team of um, teachers, um, especially within the, the corridor that I teach in. We are constantly in and out of each other's classrooms. We em empathise with things that have happened in, in the day and we are a massive support to one another. If you sort of take the big picture really, obviously I'm part of the school first and foremost, that's called Harry Tidir, which is, has a lot of staff. But then on a smaller scale then, I'm part of my faculty. Um, there are 18 teachers actually teaching uh, at the moment in, in the faculty, so I have that sort of sense of community and belonging with them as well. I feel that I belong in school because everybody looks out for each other. So I know that I'm part of lots of different teams in school. So I've got the people that I teach with. I've got the people that help me to look after um, year seven and year eight, like pupil support, Mr Barlow. And then I've got the pupils themselves, and they're really, really important to me that they think that they're part of the same team as me. I've never seen it as my library. It's very much our library, and it should be. It's not driven by my interests, it's driven by our interests, and that is so, so important. It's Slavage Paub. This is really, really important. Um, a library is like a service to the community, and that's the school community. So each and every one of us in our school community, it needs to reflect um, your interests, our interests. 
So my sense of belonging in the library is driven by all of you, my colleagues and, and uh, the pupils. Well, I think that all teachers try their very best to connect and engage with the pupils in school. We always try our very best. We give 100% of our time and effort. But like in society, sometimes it doesn't always work. But if we have that commitment from the teachers first and foremost, I would say that relationships are very strong and the pupils will have that sense of belonging. Yes, definitely. I think Kenevin being involved in my lessons is really important because for me, Kenevin, like I said before, is about being happy, being positive, sense of well-being, feeling secure. And it, it's, it's my job as a teacher to make sure that pupils I teach feel that sense. And if they do, I think, then they will feel happier and they'll work better and they will, will have a positive learning environment. Kenefin is really important because if we don't foster the fact that everyone belongs here and make all the year sixes in particular, because that's another part of my job, feel that they'll be welcome and that they'll belong when they get here, it's really hard to make sure that they work together as a team. So it's a really important thing and I think we definitely need to foster that a little bit more and lots of things like this, hopefully, will improve the way people see that they do definitely belong in Uskull Harry to Deer. Libraries should be a space for everyone. That's something I've always been passionate about ever since I wanted to become a librarian ever since I became a librarian. One of the things I try to do is make the library as, as welcoming and as comfortable as possible. So the soft fairy lights as you come in, just to soften the atmosphere. Lots of displays changing throughout the year. Six Nations Rugby, Black History Month, World Environment Day. So things local things within Wales and then the wider world as well. It's your library and we want to make it that space that, that you want to be and have things that you want to read in here. And of course our clubs as well, which are driven by your interests. Comics and Manga Club, we've just started because pupils wanted to set that up. Yeah, I think it's a school-wide issue really. I think pupil support is, is there to help and you know it's, it's in the name people support we we try our best i think you know we could we can always do better um you know we could have more staff to try and try try and do other things rather than sort of picking you up and having a chat with you we could have a specific place that we could you know a specific room that we could come and have a chat to you in so there's lots of things that we're working on and lots of things i'm trying to implement um and trying to move forward but yes we could certainly do better but i think at the moment you know, we all do our best and you know, for, for you, um, and that's something that we can work on, certainly, yeah. If pupils don't feel like they belong, the first thing that they can do is they come and have a conversation and open up and feel listened to, have their voices heard. There's got to be that person that you can speak to. There's the new Eco and Gardening Group, there is also a new LGBTQ plus um, community uh, groups. We have got a key stage three group and there is a key stage four group. Um, and I can, I can even attend groups with people to help them feel like they belong and go from there. There are many pupils who have a um, lack of their sense of belonging, um, especially from a, a Welsh language point of view. Um, I feel that there are many pupils who don't have the pride that they are Welsh, that they have grown up in this in this country and that this is the country that they now live in. Wales is a wonderful country. We have many wonderful things to be proud of. Uh, we now are introducing the new curriculum. Um, we, we will be learning lots of new stuff about Wales and its culture. Um, we'll be learning all about sort of the wonderful features that we have in Wales um, and also in, you know, in our own county, uh, we'll be looking at the history of the language and we'll also look at um, historical figures so that hopefully pupils will feel that sense of pride and uh, you know, maybe get a few heroes from doing that.
and uh, I've had a really enjoyable experience in Club Canavan. I've met lots of new people and I've it's got to work with things that I've never I've exactly known about before. It's been a great experience. I've never really did anything like this before, so I think I've like learned a lot um, because I didn't have the first clue about how like cameras or microphones or anything like lights would work. So when you watch interviews now on documentaries, you know how it is in the background, which is very cool. I've enjoyed a lot from from you from a. Uh from going around to places I'd never been before in the school, like the wellbeing garden. And also, I've also enjoyed um, just meeting new people. I've really enjoyed it because I've learned how to use all the filming equipment and it's been really fun.